Good morning. It's Tuesday. Yeah. 8.30am, would you believe? Up bright and early this morning. Quarter to five I was up. Um, Peter went fishing. He was gone by half past five. So I, as a dutiful wife, got up and done his lunch to take with him. I didn't have to. He always tells me I don't have to, but I do it. Um... So, I thought I'd pop on and change Annie, my chubby Annie. Yeah, theme Thursday this week is up in the air. So, we thought we're going to give Annie a little change, aren't we, Annie? Eh? How you all been doing? You all still, that's it, saying, staying safe out there. We actually went out for a drive yesterday. Didn't get out and have a walk, but we went out for a drive. Um, my husband's so funny, he wouldn't have the car windows open until we was out of town. I mean, we, we live on the edge of the... We don't live right in town anyway, but no. And every time somebody passed us, like on a motorbike, the window went back up again. Um... Yeah, but he's gone fishing today because oh, I can't undo this button. He's right out in the countryside and uh, he won't be near, oh goodness me, any other anglers. So he's out in the country. I'm taking off this lovely little Peter rabbit outfit. And where is he? Uh, give me the upper tail. And I'm on my phone, so I don't know how much memory I've got on there. But we're going to give it a go, see how far we get. So if I get cut off, you'll know why. Um, got a new baby coming. I know. Yeah, I've got a full body silica silicone coming. Before you get too excited, it's only a tiny one, it's only 11 inches, so I want my back really small. Could be smaller, but uh, oh, put those arms out. Yes, I don't know whether it was a good, whether I should have done it really, but uh, I did. You know what it's like, sometimes you buy something and you think, oh, did I really want it? Did I really, I didn't really need it. Did I really want it? But she's coming, so I'm just going to give her a quick little powder on her legs. I've had this so long. This little sample is so, so long because I don't often powder her. She never gets sticky, do you? You never get sticky, and it's just for protection, really. And I've got far too much on there. Look, that's probably about two pounds fifty worth on there. <laughs> Can you still see? <laughs> Fog you all out. <laughs> is not very good idea to breathe it in <coughs> is it is it probably isn't a very good idea to breathe it in it's quite warm in here i'm just going to open this window here we are so sorry if you can hear traffic. There shouldn't be much up here because I live in a cul-de-sac, but uh, you never know. She's three quarter arms, this this baby, which is a bit annoying when you're trying to dress her, but that's okay. That's okay. She's full legs. Obviously, because she's cloth body, the body doesn't need doing it ever. And we're up in the air. Birds, will that do? We're up in the air? Hope so. Are we recording? Yeah. 
Oh, yeah, this is a blue zoo baby romper. It's a bit like where's an off white creamy colour with lots of different colour birds on it. They're not, none of them are up in the air, they're not flying, they're all perched. But uh, that's as far as we got today. Um, I think the alternative was any Miss Weeks that you want to do, really. So, and I'm not sure she's worn this. I think she, well, she must have done a long time ago. It probably needs, it's been in the cupboard. It probably just needs a wash to brighten it up a little bit. Yeah, I've got a day to myself, which is nice. I'm tempted. I don't know whether to take the car out because it's three months since I've driven anywhere. And um, if I don't do it soon, <laughs> I'm never going to drive again. Uh, I might go out for a little drive. But I don't know. I might not. Yeah, I'm jumping around, I know, but yeah, so I've got a baby coming this week. I can't really put white socks on you, can I? Because that's off-white. It'll look really odd. it make it look really dirty. And just don't wear that, yeah? Just wear that. Bare feet. Bare feet. That's a bit big, really, isn't it? Room to grow. Yeah, so I saw this little silicone. I digress. I'm ever so sorry. I get back on it. I saw this little silicone for sale. Um, I saw another one last week, but no, she he wasn't. She wasn't for me. She. Um. Yeah, and then this one came along. I am Denard, and I thought, yeah, I'll, I'll think I'll have him, her, rather. Is that a bit hard for your head? Is it the Alice band? Let's keep your hair back, Alice bands are, aren't they? Keep your hair out your eyes. You haven't got any hair. So... Yeah, I paid. She's on her way. <laughs> dear, oh dear. She's uh, being posted. It was quite funny because I forgot it was um, bank holiday yesterday here in the UK. The lady I bought her from forgot she was going to post her yesterday. And of course, that never happened because it was bank holiday. So she's going to post this morning. I don't know what I'm doing now. Um, yeah, so she's on her way, or she will be, and you'll be able to see her. Uh, not to everybody's taste, I must admit, not to everybody's taste. Um, got quite a pretty face, but big hands and big feet. So, yeah, we'll see. So now... There's me complaining that Bobby was too small, and now I've gone even smaller. <laughs> even smaller I've gone. I don't know what to put on her head. Oh, found a scratch mitt. That can come out of there. That's pretty, isn't it? That's a hairband, but I've never used that one. She's got loads of others. I think they must be in a basket with her clothes. I've kept some in one place so that... Have got any red? So they were to hand when I was changing her. Yeah, I know. But... 
That's the way the cookie crumbles. You've got no purple. You've got no purple. A little tiny bit round that side. That won't go with anything, will it? Not doing much look good here, am I? Hmm? Not doing much luck. Look what I've got. Black and brown. They've never been used. They don't really go with anything. Baby colours, do they? Might be too big for your head, look. It's got a knot in it, so somebody smaller must have worn it. I'm not really into huge things like that on little heads. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> oh no, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, well, I was looking for that the other day. I put her in a, a little striped dress and couldn't find that. Right, I think I've gone through everything. That's some colours that was quite pale though, isn't it? It's a bit big to have on your head. Don't know. I brought another one in with me, but I don't even know what I did with that now. Oh. I was watching... Um, Holly Church's video this morning. Embarrassing things that happen. <laughs> She's so funny. Oh, I haven't really had any embarrassing things like that. I'm sure I haven't. I probably think of loads, but I've been racking my brain since seeing Holly's do this tag. About embarrassing things that happen to you and I haven't I can't think of any I really can't think of any um I mean things like you fall over in places but oh they weren't funny <laughs> but uh that that hair back that bow doesn't go either does it it's quite pretty that romper yeah so no I've, I've had nothing like that at all um, no, first, then Suzanne did a, a, ta a, a tag. Do you remember your first kiss? No, <laughs> very mem memorable, wasn't it? Um, I remember my first serious kisses. Hmm. They were nice. Um, I think when we went to uh, a friend of mine I went to school with, she lives in America now actually. She, um, Her mum used to do girls brigade and her dad did boys brigade. Well, we always went to boys brigade. Much more fun than going to girls brigade. And on a Friday uh, at the same place, they had... Um, a Friday night club we used to go to, where in one big room they played table tennis and different things. And then in the back room, they had a dark room where they had music playing and you did get snogged in there, which was very nice. Yeah. But um, unlike Suzanne, who didn't enjoy her first kisses, <laughs> <laughs> Mine were quite nice. <laughs> yeah, this uh, this club was under a church, part of a church. Well, no, it was a, a church hall at the side of the church or chapel. It was side of the chapel, and uh, yeah, it was nice. We didn't get up to anything; just a bit of smooching. But uh, yeah, and that was it. That was it. Right. Yeah, the little one that I almost bought last week. There was a little one um, poured by the same person who did this. Can't remember her name now. But also, 
painted by the same lady that did this one. Two different people, but so that was a quite a bit of a strange coincidence. But Annie here, yeah, her painting isn't top notch. She was a prototype, but she has got, you can't see now because I've covered it up with powder. She's got green splodges on her legs that look like bruises. Can you see that? Yeah. So I tried to do a lot of close-up pictures of this other one that, oh, sorry, another partial she was, a little one. And I, no, I wasn't convinced that she was very nice, really. So I didn't go for her. And I went for this other little one. Hey, we will see. But now I'm looking for, she's 11 inches. Now I'm looking for tiny clothes. So I was looking for knitting patterns. You can get 10 inch, you can get 12 inch. So I think I'm going to have to try and find 12 inch things. Oh God, my neck's hurting. I don't know, I slept funny last night. I've got, I'm in pain. Um, yeah, so I'm going to have to try and find. I've ordered one knitted set, already knitted, off of eBay. I don't know whether she comes with any clothes. I never asked. The lady said, I'll do you a nice box opening. So, I don't know. I don't know whether that could be clothes or whether it could be a box of chocolates. <laughs> I haven't got a clue. I'm hoping it's clothes because obviously I'm not going to have any of that size. Um, I gave away all my tiddly little things. Years ago, I used to make a lot of 10-inch dolls. And at that time, I used to be able to buy little things and for prem babies up to like a pound. And... Yeah, I haven't got any of that anymore, nothing like that. And I went back online and they, you know, the prices have gone up. Mm, well, from a few years, I suppose they would really, wouldn't they? But, um, yeah, so I'm looking. I suppose I'll have to look for actual doll clothes opposed to baby clothes. Um this sculpt she was actually created in america and this person does make a lot of them over there and i know the clothes are available over there people make clothes for them but oh, that's my washing machine taking off um yeah it's trying to find because i don't want to have to pay customs on things that i buy whether you do on clothes, I don't know. I assume you do. Somebody can tell me. Um, and they're not cheap. I, there's a lady on Etsy sells them. Um, but they are not cheap. So I might have to get my sewing machine out and give that a go. We will see. She might come. I might decide I don't like her and sell her on. But I think she looks quite cute. So, where she's going to sleep, I have no idea. But she won't take up much room, will she? And I'm hoping Peter goes fishing again Thursday in case she comes then. Anyway, there's Annie. My beautiful Annie. That hair, band, that hair ribbon doesn't go. I know she doesn't go, but there we are. I will... Right, oh. Got a message. I will rake out all her other hair bows sometime. Actually, I've got all her clothes in a basket. And if I emptied those out, well, not all her clothes, but a majority of her clothes in a wicker basket, if I found somewhere else for those, this little one could sleep in there. Hmm, possible, possible, possibility that is. But what do I do with all her clothes? It's a nightmare, isn't it? Absolute nightmare. Anyway, 
Yvonne, up in the air. But these aren't, are they? These some oh somebody must be putting the bins out. Pete's forgotten gone fishing and forgotten to put the bins out. I wonder if I'd be able to take them. Is one's regard garden recycling this week, and I don't expect I'll even be able to move it. But they come tomorrow, so it's got to go out. Right, say bye bye. Say bye bye. Bye bye, everybody. Bye bye. I'll see you soon. Bye.